Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name's Karen and I have been living the keto lifestyle for a year and three months now. So this is just gonna be a really quick video. I had to jump on and make a video because my husband bought me something. He's always surprising me with things. And this is the new surprise. It is a little waffle maker. Now, I don't know how. I never knew about shaffles, I think they call them. Chaffles, shaffles, it's like a cheese and egg waffle. It's a deal breaker. Like, it is so good and so easy to make and feels like you're eating a waffle. It's just amazing. So I haven't really looked up any recipes yet, but I definitely plan on doing an organized like recipe video of all the different types of shaffles or chaffles. I, gotta, I don't even know how to say it, but it's delicious. And my daughter has been asking for them every morning. I got this, what, I don't know, maybe five days ago, six days ago. And every morning she's been asking for me to make her one, which is great. It's so much healthier than her eating frozen pancakes or whatever you know, she's been eating. So I had to jump on and just tell you guys about this because it really is a keto game changer. So I really have like no time. I just got back from a run. I have to work today. Uh, cleaning lady's coming tomorrow, so I'm supposed to straighten up this house, but I just needed to jump on and show you how easy this is. So I will put a link in my description below that you can click and it'll take you to Amazon if you want to buy one of these. This is a little bigger than there's little mini ones that I saw that are really popular. They're only like 10 bucks, I think but Jimmy always buys stuff a little bit bigger. Like he saw the size of those little ones. He's like, who's gonna, you can have to make two every time. So it's a little bit bigger, but I heard the mini ones are really good too. So I'm gonna plug it in, let it heat up. This just has a stand for storage. So this is a flip one. So what you do is you put the, it's gonna heat up. When this light goes out, it's ready. You don't need any spray or anything like that. It's nonstick. So you're gonna put the egg mixture on one side, close it and flip it. But just, I haven't measured anything yet and they've always come out really good. So I don't like to make things dirty. I'm really always in a rush. So basically you just put two eggs. And I, when I do the recipes, I'm gonna try ones that don't taste so eggy. I don't mind the egg taste and neither does my daughter. But there are ways, like if you just use egg whites, it won't taste as eggy. Ah, shells. I just want to show you how quick this is in the morning. Oh, that thing's supposed to be closed while it's heating up. So two eggs. I do just a little bit of heavy whipping cream. I don't measure. I will try to get some measurements for you guys. I just put a little bit in. And cheese and whatever spices you like. And that's it. It's so simple and I can't believe my picky picky daughter likes them my son won't try them yet he's really picky but my picky daughter likes them so I don't know how much this is I'm gonna say I would think it's about a half cup but I will I promise I'm gonna look up recipes and I'm gonna make a real organized video tasting different kinds you could make chocolate ones you could put cocoa powder in there you could make like sweet ones with cream cheese that are almost like a cake. There's so many different ways. You can put any spices you want in there. Um, I'm gonna do a little Himalayan pink sea salt with black pepper and garlic. But you can make this like dessert tasting, however you like it, and it's so quick. And you don't dirty any dishes, except the fork. That's it. So you just put all that crap in there, stir it up, if it feels like there's too much of anything, like I didn't measure, I could always put another egg in. Maybe just an egg white, because it is a little bit thick, but I'm just gonna go for it. I really can't believe I went this long doing keto without knowing about this. I've never had a waffle maker in my life, ever. I don't know why. It's so easy and it stores so easy. It fits right in my cabinet. A lot of things that I have, like I have a huge, Jimmy wise everything big, that huge pressure cooker, I don't know how big it is, but it's huge. I, I can't fit it in any of my cabinets here, so I gotta put it in my storage, so I never wanna use it, because I gotta go take it out. Same thing with my crock pot. I got me this huge crock pot to feed like 10 people. And I never use it, because it's hidden. I need things like out, 
I'm gonna use them. All right, light's not out yet, come on, because I had it. I had it open. Yes, I have so many different ideas. So many different shuffles to try. Okay, lights out, let's go. Let's go, pour it in. I probably should be seeing this better, huh? I'm really kind of over here. Just spread it out a little bit. Make sure it fills up all the holes. That's it, close it. I think you're supposed to flip it right away. I really didn't need, read any instructions, but flip it. And set a timer for like four minutes. And that's it, we just wait four minutes and then we have something besides like regular eggs to eat. It actually tastes different and just psychologically looking at it, looking like a waffle makes it taste different. So while this is cooking, I just want to tell you guys, if you saw my last video, how much I love my skin. <laughs> I'm so excited. The vampire facial was awesome and my skin hasn't looked this good in a long time. So somebody, one of my uh, subscribers commented on my before and after picture. So I'm gonna be completely honest. There's something called clickbait. You know, I'm not talking about you guys, my subscribers, you'll always watch my videos, but if I wanna get like more people just to get interested in my channel, so I took a bad, you know, profile picture for the before picture just to you know, make more people watch and be interested. But you could see from the videos themselves, the difference in my skin tone, because I did some bad lighting after pictures, like the, the second day, the third day, I didn't use any lighting. So just for that one subscriber, I'm sorry that the before picture didn't look true yet. It was a really horrible shot of me. It was a horrible angle and horrible lighting, but maybe it'll make more people click and more people subscribe to my channel and then I can change them all into the keto lifestyle and make everybody happy. All right, so this thing, saying two minutes left. I like mine a little bit more well done. I don't want it like gooey in the middle. So I'm excited to do all these different recipes and oh, it's beeping, but it still says it's counting down. Let's see what's going on. I'm going to flip it back. I want to take a peek. Oh, that's looking good. All right. Wow. So this nonstick thing works awesome. Comes right out. Let's see what the other side looks like. Oh, it's perfect. That's it guys, unplug it. Look at that. Awesome. All right, so I just slap some butter on this and that's all, I just put butter on it. My daughter likes it with some syrup, but we can use like, you know, keto sugar-free syrup. I'm more like a, a eggy. What are you eating, Liam? Christmas time is always tough for a cat. Thank you, had a light bulb in his mouth. Alright, so I don't have time to let this butter melt, but these come out different every time I make them because I don't measure them and I just throw different stuff in all the time. But let's go for it. Mm. I don't know how I live without these. I really don't. You have to get one of these waffle makers and you have to start making shuffles, I think they're called. But look that up. They're so good and they're so easy to make and there's no mess and I have to get in the shower because I have to go to work so I gotta finish this. But I just had to let you guys know because you can't go another day without making shoppers. All right guys, I hope you like my channel. Please subscribe if you wanna see more videos and I will see you soon with a full on recipe video of all the different <laughs> types of shoppers that I can figure out how to make. Bye guys, have a great day.